video, I'll be discussing the Evaluator Trip System Planner version 2. The Evaluator system helps us manage risk by taking into consideration the current avalanche conditions and the characteristics of the terrain we'll be traveling in. Here's how the Evaluator system works. On the back of the card, you'll find six questions regarding the current avalanche conditions and four questions regarding the terrain characteristics. Each question is scored with a zero, plus one, or plus two. Let's look at the avalanche conditions questions first. Question number one, regional danger rating. Is the avalanche danger rating considerable or higher? Question number two, persistent avalanche problems. Is there a persistent or deep persistent slab problem in the snowpack? Question number three, slab avalanches. Are there signs of slab avalanches in the area from today or yesterday? Question number four, signs of instability. Are there signs of snowpack instability, including whoops, shooting cracks, or drum-like sounds? Question number five, recent loading. Has there been loading within the past 48 hours, including roughly 30 centimeters of new snow or more, significant wind transport or rain? Question number six, critical warming. Has there been a recent rapid rise in temperature to near zero degrees or is the upper snowpack wet due to strong sun above freezing air temperatures or rain? Remember your score from the avalanche condition questions and then answer the terrain characteristics questions. Question number one, slope steepness is in two parts. Part one, is the slope steepness between 30 and 35 degrees or is the slope steeper than 35 degrees? Question number two, terrain traps. Are there gullies, trees, or cliffs that increase the consequence of being caught in an avalanche? Question number three, slope shape. Is the slope convex or unsupported? Question number four, forest density. Is the slope in the alpine in a sparsely treed area or an open forest? Now all we have to do is take our score from the avalanche condition questions and our score from the terrain characteristic questions and put them on this chart on the front of the card. Where the two scores meet on the evaluator chart gives us the evaluator trip planner risk assessment for our trip. Green means exercise regular caution. Yellow means exercise extra caution and red means our trip is not recommended. That's the evaluator trip planner system version 2.